Okay, so this is a project from the Carved Biomorphic Abstraction uh, discussion. This is created by Nick Sutton. Uh, I hope I said his name right. Um, so this appears to be, at first glance, it looks like a lightning bolt, which was probably intended, but it's not exactly a lightning bolt. Um, it has a different form than the stereotypical one that you might see in uh, pictures or clip art or um, or even the Harry Potter symbol on the forehead that's become very famous. It looks something somewhat similar to that even though it doesn't have the exact shape. Um, it has the jagged endings um, pointing out in different directions and it is um, carved out of the, the pink purplish styrofoam block that we were given. Um, yeah. Okay, and then for how it was put together, um, just as we were instructed for the carved biomorphic abstraction, uh, this, this project was, um, just shaved down from the initial block that we were given. Um, it was at first, um, just a smooth, uh, smooth, large block of styrofoam and the artist uh, shaved it down um, quite a bit and getting some areas uh, to be very uh, very straightforward and very smooth and other areas being very jagged and um, not exactly a straight line as other lines have been um, and then for why for my my best guess to interpret this is that I don't, I'm not sure, but my guess would be that it's almost like a symbol of power. When I think of a lightning bolt, I think of someone that's powerful, someone that has um, like innate abilities that catches people people's eye. Like this automatically um, caught my eye. So I think it's somewhat a symbol of power or of strength. Definitely the opposite of weakness, um, and it's very it's very bold and popping out of you um like involving the the audience by popping out and it does this because it is a relief sculpture and the property of it jumping out like that and being carved from the block and not being removed as many of the other projects were give it a very strong power uh presence a very strong presence um that can't be ignored by the audience and for the valuation, I believe that this piece was definitely very successful. Um, I personally really enjoy this piece. I, I'm not sure why, but it just really resonates with me. Um, I just love the, the different lines um, going from a straight line to a jagged line to a diagonal line and the different forms of lines um, and even using like negative space of not filling in the other areas because it's a relief sculpture and carving it out of the block i think that this this piece was done excellently i just love this piece so much and for the different lines and for the mainly the unique shape and being carved from outside the block that just really grabs audiences attention